All right guys, so when you walk in, this is what you're going to get, a review of symptoms. You check off any things you might be dealing with so that they can customize a treatment just for you. So let's take a look. I'm gonna show you what I'm dealing with these days. I can promise you fatigue is at the top of this list, but you go through the list and anything specifically that you want them to treat with the IV infusion, they can help you with. All right, so let's see. Fatigue, check that a couple times. <laughs> Oh, even things like excessive thirst, look at there. Definitely, you can hear in my voice, nasal congestion is a current issue here dealing with. All right. And we'll click brain fog too, because that's just a general state of being. All right, now we wait for the doctor. Tell me about the, the health benefits that are conferred here. And well, this is really good because as you sit in it, what we love to do is tell you to come in. It helps to relax you so your cardiovascular system runs a little bit better. Right. The veins kind of get a little more vasodilated. The blood's flowing through the body better, which helps decrease your blood pressure, mm -hmm. which helps you feel a little bit better. And then we pull you right out of here and give you an IV, which now rehydrates you. Okay. Um, kind of gives you that little bit of boost of energy with the vitamins that we have. So this would be the first step if we were doing like a combination Absolutely. treatment. Absolutely. This first and then. The absolutely okay yep. and how long do we have to chill out in there 30 minutes that's okay. it Great. so what we do is we heat it up to 130 degrees and I'll show you here we just you'll click it on and then you'll notice all the controls here you actually have access to on the inside so if at any point you're getting you feel like you're getting overheated or you're like you know what I've been here 30 minutes I only want to do 20 today mm -hmm. you can actually access it down you can't put the time up from inside okay we have control of that from the outside but other than that it gives you kind of a comfort level of knowing that you can come in right and you're not stuck right oh yes we do not want to be stuck in a warm box I have to ask too there has been a lot of press Ooh, that's pretty mm -hmm. there's been a lot of press about the um, like the long-term health benefits of doing a sauna treatment this is far infrared you said uh, it's infrared sauna, yep. Infrared sauna. Mm -hmm. and is this something that could like impact long-term health too? I feel like on some health bloggers we're seeing people talk about like doing this as a regular part of your routine to like Absolutely. help your overall health. Absolutely. We actually have a wellness package that we offer here that's really nice and it includes our IM shots, our IVs, and our sauna. Mm -hmm. uh, we use it kind of as a weight loss treatment too. Oh, um, so you're kind of getting the whole package. So it comes in, you come in, you sit in your sauna for 30 minutes, you get your IV, we okay. offer food sensitivity testing with it okay. so it's a testing that you can get we take three vials um, of blood from you mm -hmm. we send it off to the lab they send it back and we'll actually send you a whole packet that shows you what you might have kind of reactions to so you might be having some upset stomach reflux or issues with Crohn's or GERD or anything along those lines mm -hmm. but you don't know exactly what you're eating that's causing the issue right so this will say you know what cauliflower might taste good to you but cauliflower is actually what's causing your GERD or what's you know assisting in upsetting your Crohn's so it really breaks it down level by level so you can see what you're reacting to that's great so you can really know what exactly you're dealing with before you move on to treatment exactly And a little bit of stuffiness, it's like mm -hmm. the time when all this stuff is going around school, so mm -hmm. everyone in our family is a little bit sick. Sure. Those are the two main concerns. Got it. Got uh, it. Yeah. In interrupted sleep in general. Um, to begin with, usually people who are very active, um, we all are, you know, we can make energy, and it's made in, like, to take you all the way down to the cellular level in something called mitochondria, which is our little stores that produce energy. And over the past 10 years, I would say it's become really come to light in the scientific community. It's not necessarily production, it's the release of energy from that mitochondria. And that's why people feel lethargic, not as moving as fast as they used to, and their neurons are not synapsing as fast, and you're kind of foggy and in a daze. So B vitamins, there's um, it's B1, B2, B3, B5, B6, B7, it's a whole family, we call it B complex are usually the ones that are responsible for not just the production but the release of that energy from the mitochondria. And it's an immediate type of a thing. Typically people who are deprived um, of the B vitamins exactly experience the fatigue, kind of like living in a daze. Right. And it's almost an immediate um, turnaround when they get these vitamins. And why IV is because I think intravenously it goes directly into your cells within minutes, into your cells 
as opposed to having to travel through your mouth, into your stomach, into your gut. Most people have such problems with their guts, they can't just absorb any of these vitamins through the gut. So typically, if you take a pill of the vitamin, it's about 20% absorption rate. And then if you take it, obviously IV, 100% of it is available to the cell. That's why it's such an immediate rush of energy that you feel, because they're more active that way. Right, okay, so here's what I'm dealing with these yeah. days. Exhaustion is the biggest yeah. factor. I yeah. still have interrupted sleep with, with the, my youngest. Yeah. Um, the brain fog that you yeah. mentioned, I checked that box too, because I feel like there are days when yeah. there is a word on the tip of my tongue for, and it takes me a solid like <laughs> 10 minutes to right. remember, oh, and by the time the conversation's over. So those are the two big things. Yeah. Um, but just a general feeling of like needing a boost of energy, yeah. like hearing all this, like yeah. what comes off the top of your head is something that would be yeah. in my infusion. In your infusion will be free three parts. So number one will be vitamin C, very high dose, but very safe dose. And that will give you, it's good for everything. It's basically a major building block of collagen. So it's good for your skin, for your hair, for your nails. It's an immune booster. Um, I'm a cancer surgeon by day. As a matter of fact, I believe in it so much and it's a complete segue that I'm leaving cancer surgery world to do this full time. Wow. Because now I'm not cutting out cancers anymore, I'm preventing them. Yeah, let's and there's, just hop on that for one second. And that's a whole you different should. segue. I love that yes. though. And people are taking charge of their health yeah. these days. And we're doing things like this. There's a sort of like a constellation of things that we're doing, like I said, supplementation or yeah. IV therapy that our parents like didn't do or know about. So we have access to all this cool stuff. How do we make sure that we're choosing the right like combination of things? You can choose. You can choose sprinkles on your cupcakes at a cupcake <laughs> shop, okay? You need a doctor to sit down, look through your history, even drill down to the lab and make a comprehensive consultation and an evaluation and a treatment plan for you. So it's not up to you to choose. It's up to you working very closely with the physician to work on what's right for you. So could I bring my blood labs yes. in and you yes. would take a look at them? Absolutely. And just, I think that's fascinating, Absolutely. okay. Yeah, because you know, we're doing like all these things sort of separately, but it's nice to know there's one place where you can bring it and you're reviewing everything right. beginning right. to end. To make it a comprehensive plan. Okay. Typically, depending on the lab, some labs are very general and they don't necessarily go into the specifics of what kind of vitamins level you have and whatnot, a typical lab you would get through a typical doctor. There are much more sophisticated labs that kind of drill down into the molecule itself and into your cells itself and say, hey, this is what you're lacking and this is what you need and whatnot. But as of today, as of right now, we'll just do an empiric thing that helps, I would say, 90% of the patients of the people, and that's the vitamin C. Um, so it's an immune booster. We got a segue off of that. It's uh, anti-cancer therapy as well at certain doses. Absolutely, people are curing ovarian cancer now with vitamin C. So there's tons of research on that. And that's just one of the cancers. And it's good for your hair and nails and your beauty. Then we'll put those B-complex vitamins. That will give you that immediate boost of energy but I call it Zen energy. It's not the energy where you're jittery at midnight and you can't fall asleep. You fall asleep peacefully, but you wake up, bright eye, bushy tail, whenever your day starts, and you just keep on going. And then finally, there is this molecule called glutathione. It's an antioxidant. Most people have never heard it or can't pronounce it, but there's about 70,000 studies on it in the scientific community. Um, we produce it on our own up to the age of about seven, and then after that, our rate of production slows down. And we feel like that's kind of one of the key molecules to wellness, to overall well-being, to athletic performance, to energy, and you know, kind of overall goodness. Mm -hmm. So those three big components will be in the bag. Okay, now we head over to the pod to relax while we get the IV infusion. You might actually even taste the B-complex vitamins. So right. you might get a little bit of a, oh my a vitamin gosh. taste in your mouth. I swear you said that and they already do. Totally normal. The big misconception with IVs is people think, oh my God, the needle's in my arm, I can't move. Because that's where the brain fog is. You have the cells, they just don't communicate. My, my brain cells like have no cell service left. They're in like, <laughs> they're in like, <laughs> The black zone. We <laughs> they have not talked. They think that. Okay. Please make them talk yeah. again.